ijoba re gberun odun ta nsoro nigba na oju afoju yo la gbogbo awon afoju pata ko awon afoju yo la eti awon aditi yo si nigba na ni awon aro yo fo soke bi agbanrin ati ahode yo korin koni si ala isara kan de kene kan ko ninu ijoba na no gbogbo yo wa ni alaafia bipe by the time jesus shall come the millennial reign then the eyes of the blind shall be opened and the ears of the earth shall be unstopped then shall the lame man leap as an axe and the tongue of the dumb sing for in the wilderness shall break out and streams in the desert during that time there shall never be any fiscally challenged people you read 33 said 24 33 24 everybody we experience perfect Isaiah sixty one. One to three. And and Belarami, was to she. the ati she still e tubu fun awon onde lati kede odun ite won gba oluwa ati ojo esan olorun wa lati tu gbogbo awon tin gba awe ninu lati yan fun awon tin sofo fun sioni lati fi lati fi oso fun won nipo eru ororo ayo nipo ofo aso eyin nipo emi banuje ki a le pe won ni igi ododo ogbe oluwa ki a le yin logo ne uh, isaiah uh, sorry psalm 72 7 and 8 o ti je ka mu pe gbugbu aye alaafia pe pe opolopo alaafia ni gbugbu aye 72 7 and 8 we are made to so understand that the whole world we experience perfect and complete peace ni ajo re ni awon olodo yo gbile ati opolopo alaafia ni won bi o su pa yo su pe to owo si je ba lati okun di okun Yes. It's my prayer that that very time should come in an end. This period come in an end. The Lord knows the, uh, the condition of the world now. So the Lord knows the condition of the world now. And there is no work that can keep you up except when you arrive and establish the kingdom. Oh Lord, we are praying that you should come on time. That's what you say. We are making progress. We are making progress. We are making progress. We are We so it was uh, from Adam. In, in 1 Corinthians 15, 15, 22, and 26. Nitori bi ogbe ni yon ti kuni no adamu. Be ni a so ogbe ni yon di ala yeni no kristi. I kuni yon ta ika yin. Ti a ok parun. Yes. Ogbe ni yon jogo eko. Ni pa se adamu. We all inherited death. Through Adam. We don't need to say much on that. Yes. Christian, I can feel something. Christian, we are moving. We are going to 
What we are saying now is that Christ is going to come to remove that curse. When is he going to remove the curse? The curse of death we inherited through Adam. Christ the Lord shall remove the curse of death from man, the one inherited uh, through Adam. So this one is going to be removed. Anybody that dies that time dies by himself. If we all understand the situation, I think the prayer point that Jesus said we should say first is the one we should be praying for right now. Which says, let the kingdom come. Crazy, you move a goy co cro lori bo brainia. Jesus said, die, make a go, father, sorry, fumbo brainia. Christ the Lord shall remove the curse from man and restore long life back unto man. Bo brainia, one lie. Cogasino, I get the tongue. We shall all remain alive from millennial reign into the new world where there shall be no more death. So we should not forget. We should not forget. You should not forget that some people are not going to be worthy of that kingdom. They are not going to be partakers of the kingdom. As we are told with the money, all the wicked, all the sinners must have been removed. No wonder you see the expression, repent ye therefore, for the kingdom of God is at hand. It's so prevalent in the Bible. Let us make ourselves worthy for this kingdom. We want to continue with the teaching. Pay any I want to support what I said earlier on concerning the fact that the Lord is going to remove death. That a time shall come when we are not going to experience any incident of death again. It seems as if in Yoruba land, I don't know of any other place, when you talk of anything joy, uh, that of death is the greatest. But the time shall come when we will not hear of death again. Revelation chapter 21. Kennedy, I One to five. Most of you are to come as I have to come. Need only to come as I have to go to the law. Oh, who was Jerusalem to do to your own son. That's your long one. See, I was let be. I was a lot of four corner. Most of you are going to come as I have to come. I got to come as I have to come. Oh, my bad one. Oh, my Jenny. Yes. And it's 
Yes. There shall be no more death. You have had the passage of the The statement I want you to take note of there has to do with there shall be no more death. Where will that be during that time? When the Bible says there shall be no more death, that means death is a being, a personality. In chapter 20 of the book of Revelation, verse 14, there we shall see where death will go. And death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. And so those people who are involved in celebration, especially during burial, uh, what do you think will happen to you on the day of judgment? Because right now you are rejoicing with Satan when he accomplishes his work concerning death. What will be your lot at the end? When we are talking about the lake of fire, it's not all about burning of a piece of paper. When God laid this assignment in my heart, I want I want to one See you There was a particular group or a denomination for preaching concerning the kingdom of God that is coming. I wanted to join them. Suban I decided not to join them that very point in time just because of this very expression that uh, there is no lake of fire anywhere. That the case is just like burning a, uh, throwing a piece of paper into the fire and when it burns, when it, when it, that is going to be the end. What is the stand of the scripture according to Revelation chapter 20, verse 10? Are they going to be burnt up just like that? Why is it so that one gets a sin like that? We know at this full room, maybe the other quality will be okay. I was my dad, one of those on top of lie at the lie lie. The Bible says, and they shall be tormented day and night forever and ever. Jesus, la na de sabe ni lo epe. Onto ba buke ni lo be. Bo ba joju ni kopa da nore. Juke ko lo sne eko eko ipan keke eko ilope. Jesus also mentioned something related to this. That if it were to be your eye that will lead you to hellfire. You should have you should accept 
to lose that eye rather than, rather than for you to go to the lake of fire. Pupa anwe ni an. Tong bara la ni si ti wo ro nuku wada. O te su fin san la kan ni po po lo sa juku la. Ko sa ni te o ni ku. Ta le ni bi te o kuri. Bo pe ni o sa ku na ni. Iku na ni o kun re. Iku ni o kun re. Iku yi so o kun re ese. Many people who are been preached to or who are listening to the word of God today, they refuse to accept the gospel to their lives because they have that thought that the uh, aftermath is dead. That is never the end. You should not believe that erroneous notion from Satan. They shall be tormented day and night forever and ever. And it's your back. 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 Uh, anyone who shall die during the millennial reign will be as a result of self-committed sin and not that of the sin committed by Adam. Me, Isaiah 65, 20 to 22. Isaiah 65, 20 to 22. Isaiah 65, 20 to 22. Isaiah 65, 20 to Shukun e lese ologo aru adun yo de eni fibu won si ko ile won si gbe ilo won won si gbe agbajara won si je iso won won ki yo ko ile fun elomira lati gbe won ki yo gbe fun elomira lati je nitori gege bi ojo igili ojo awon eniyan mi ri awon anyan fe mi yo si jifa si owo won yes esogun verse 20 yo si omo wa ni be ti ojo re ki yo pe tabi agba kan ti ojo re kokun nitori omo de yo ku le ogo run odun omo de aku le ogo run odun gbo elese ologo run odun elese ni eni ifibun ni o se lo o se ko run pa da lo ese re lo je kokun sugba ka to fi ku si egba na ko ni din si ogo run odun omo ogo run odun e je ko mo pe misaya wa lori ite there shall be no more days an infant of days, nor an old man that has not filled his days. For the child shall die another years old. But the sinner, be another years old, shall be accursed. So nobody will be less than a hundred years. Nobody will die less than a hundred years. So, can you tell me about Ah, if somebody should die a hundred years old, people will continue to say, ah, it's very, very old. But during the millennial reign, whosoever will die will not be less than a hundred years, and he would have committed a sin. During this millennial reign, no woman will give back a mystery. We are going to have two different bodies during the millennial reign. So, but I have a family that is not in the same place. I can't see. I can't see. If you are privileged to be part of those who shall go on the day of rapture, we will not be, uh, we will not suffer along with these people who will be given back during the millennial reign. Luke, Luke chapter 20. Luke chapter 33 to 36. 33 to 36. Luke 20, 33 to 36. In there, li agi in de oku, aya tita li yo a she di no wang. Ni tori awo menge, menge ge, menge, awo menge ge, menge ge, li o sa ni li aya, jesu si down, o si wifu wangpe, awo ma ye yi, ama agbe ya wo, wang si ma fa ya wo founi, shuban, awo ti aka ye la ti gengu a ye nan, a ti agi in de kuro ni no oku, Mwa ki be ya wo, mwa ki si fa ya wo founi. Nito ni mwa kole kuma, nito iti mwa ba wangeli dogba. 
awon omo olorun si ni won nitori won di awon ma jinde yes gbo wa to ba ni nipa ninu rapso igbasoke a to wa la aye ti awon oku ninu christ to jinde a to wa la aye ti apalada ti akogbo won lo si oro a o da bi angeli tin be nor awon angeli won ibi si won ire si so those of us who are going to be privileged to go on the day of rapture uh, those who are going to be raised and those who shall go and meet the Lord alive, uh, they would have been changed into the angelic body. And the angels, they don't procreate. So, my Bible auntie, oh, if you are ye, what no job I bear around to life when you call Yasmin, your Bible, or don't you told you I pay a ye, net for no good job in your Bible, or don't more my busy, more my resi, get get it, or not on name by said that. To je pe pe lu irorun ni won bi si ni won re si ko si ko si bata ni ti kin ni kan ni gba ni gba te ni gba ta ye bere so for those who are going to find themselves in the millennial reign with this atomic body they are the ones that shall be given back to children during that time eh oni pe an fe se kuko ti yan to ri akoko ba wo genesis 360 ani le lo ka ba wo isaiah 65 Mark to to ba fe ko sile Isaiah 25 23 to 24 Genesis 1 28 so for those who want to write it down write Genesis 3:16 Isaiah 65 23 24 Genesis 1 28 there it's Genesis 1 year 28 help me read Genesis 1 28 my busy come out is in the magba yin lori ile ko si that they should multiply and replenish the heart. Allah usi wi Allah usi sure fun wa Allah usi wi fun wa pe e ma bi si ki e si ma re ki e si gbile ki e si se ikawo re ki e si ma joba lori aye eja okun ati lori aye uju orun ati lori ohun alaye gbogbo tin ra ko lori ile. Yes. Go to journey gbogbo e ma bi se ma re si ko si wa la ka bi ni ma bi kan ma re si ni i need your spirit man need this mentality eh eh the, the women then should be fruitful, they should multiply and replenish the heart because there shall be no problem during that time. And even we will not be in need of any maternity or hospital. The, the redeemed shall enjoy everlasting joy as we have the record in Isaiah 35. Best thing, I you are never everlasting joy. I want you are you you are you are you are you are you are you are you and the ransom of the Lord shall return and come to Zion with songs and everlasting joy upon their heads. They shall obtain joy and gladness and sorrow and sigh shall flee away. Sorry, nobody. It will tell you about where to you must go take a bath. Sally, I am waiting on Leno. Papa, what when you know that you are Leno? Nick, they said, No, I hear you can I. Nino aye kana tori agbo aye ya siwa gbogbo ekan ta nse laaro ati ti ta nse lowo lowo yi aye yi yosua aye adam yi yosua gbogbo orilede asiwa bi won te wa ijoba lo yato si ar ijoba to yato si ara mo mo mi pe ijoba aye ni osimo a satan ni are agbaye bayi orilede kokan ni are te mo gba ti christo je are gbo faye Alafia na yo wa jaki jado gbugbu aye ti o ni si pe isele bi kan ni orilede kan mm 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 alafia ni gbugbu aye ati ko bi ni ojo re won lo dodo yo gbile ati opolopo alafia gbugbu aye by the time jesus shall come in his kingdom and shall restore everything uh, back to normal people then uh, shall be surprised that can this be so we know quite all right that there shall be peace throughout the world uh, as uh, recorded in the word of God. 
akole ti mo kan si ati wole ile pagọ wa nibi the sign board i have there at the entrance of the campground the most consumer pe akesi fun gbogbo eniya notice for her people we are here kole lala fi ati ti ijoba lorun yo fi ni the world cannot know peace until the arrival of the kingdom of god inu mi do ipe mo si de te ngba na pe akole yi ati kona ti july 1982 I'm happy because it was dated when I wrote it that it was written July 1982. Oh, I'm happy to go to Dubai. Oh, let's go to Dubai. Going to 40 years now. Eh, why we sell a few hampers in your bundle, cuz? Are we having multiplicity of peace or reduction? Kise pe mori na ya lo ju ala lo ju ira kini bibe liwi na ne. Not that I saw that in a vision or in a dream. But I checked through the Bible and I could see what the Bible is talking about. Oh, that be alias it a jani agbele wa ni radio ara ni sin kin ni bibeli wi. It's just about the name we are bearing on the, on here right now which says uh, revelation of our uh, set the Bible. Lati ba lati bere pe jo po yi lati wa lori bibeli ba soro ka so to ba dake ka dake. Right from the beginning Of this assembly, we have restricted ourselves to whatever we have in the Bible. When the Bible talks, we talk. When it doesn't talk, then we stop. And I'm very happy that we still remain till now. Be ba, be ba, be ba. Say we are doing our reading. Be ba, be ba. Say we are doing our reading. Be ba, be ba. Say we are doing our reading. To our Jacob Castle Road, yeah. Can we just be ready, be ready? Ah. Bawo ni yo ti je itiju to ka so pe se bi lodun kan se bi nigba kan ewo ewo yorun ta ti wa lori radio se be so ngba kan pe se be so ngba kan pe sugbon lati gba ti a ti bere program na lori afefe ije a ti e ri gba kan ka ni kan o pe be pe se be so ngba kan se be so ngba kan ba to je pe ori bibeli lawa ti be gba soro ka so to ba dake ka dake nobody has been able to to criticize us today or to question us about a particular portion of the bible just because we are able to stand by the word of god since the commencement of this very assembly even looking at the program we are doing on radio uh, we have question time people would have questioned us a lot are you an epe kun ye wa lori won won ri ayo ati ni dun gba ka na ati mi adun o n go wa fun lo lori ile aji to ni si ba nu je mo lori ile aji Everlasting joy shall be upon them. Sign sorrow shall all flee away. Imu ba sipo ifi ati eto lorun fu eni yini no aye yi o je di pataki ti olorun yi o tun finran Christ amo re pada wa si aye. The restoration of everything by God later in the nearest future. Is the main reason why God is going to send back Jesus into this world. Let us go to the book of Acts. Acts chapter 3. Kalo ka lati ese ikokan din logun de ikokan le logun ka mo pe to ri mo pada bo si po eto olorun ni olorun yo to fin ran Christ pada wa ko le mu o gbogbo e to to lo ni fun aye yi a e so le di e to olorun la ye lowo ko si di lowo bo a a no ni e gba ran run ijoba yin o gbogbo e da laye yo gba dun ada afi atan ba ma gbo bo ngo iba ti rin ti ba se esu ti o ti won si nu egun lati egbe ran odun wa yin so according to the book of acts chapter 3 19 to 21 there we are told that god is going to restore everything back unto man during that time And we are going to enjoy the policy and the program of God. Satan cannot withstand the plan of God. He cannot alter the plan of God. Ni tori na ero nu pe wada. Ki a si tun yi pada. Ki a le pa ise yinra. Ki a koko itura ba le ti wa ju Oluwa wa. Ati ki o ba le ran Kristi. Ti a ti yan fun yin ani Jesu. Eni ti arun ko le sa imagba. Titi di igba ibu pada on gbogbo. Ti Olorun ti so lati enu awon woli re mi mo. ti won ti nbe nigbati aye ti se yes nitori aro rupu ada ki e si tun yi pada 
Repentry therefore be converted. They are your sins may be blotted out. That the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. Marawa, bolo to saju ye eje karo nukwe wada. And we appeal to every one of us to see the need to repent. At it no malaro. We emphasize that in the morning. At it no mani alish. And we are going to repeat same tonight. Nigba ti Jesu fe bere wasu le. Nigba tu no rele aye ni a koko oroti o koko so. When Jesus, when Jesus wanted to start his ministry, when he came the first time, the first thing he said has to do with repent therefore, for the kingdom of God is at hand. I'm also telling us tonight that we should repent. We should repent so that our sins may be blotted out. Repent therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out. Repent therefore and be the reason why Jesus put off his glory in heaven, why he removed his glory, and he put on that very uh, terrestrial body, is for him to be able to redeem man, to use his blood for the remission of our sins. Uh, Matthew Oriogu S28. There is a confirmation in Matthew 20, verse 8. 28. 28. Matthew 2028. 20, Matthew 2028. Ani gaga bi even as the Son of Man came not to be ministered unto, but to minister and to give his life a ransom for many. To use his blood as a ransom for many. If you read what happened or why Jesus was on the cross, when he was crucified, and he was pierced at the reef by that very spear, and the blood gushed out. When the blood gushed out from his ribs and was flowing to the river, then Jesus said, It is finished. He said, that is the work he came to do. Oh, Paris. It is finished. Oh, Paris. It is finished. Back at the way, Revelation. Revelation chapter 1. Yes, I caro. Verse 5. His blood is meant for our redemption. Because if you kill, if one should kill all the elephants in the wilderness and use his blood, the blood cannot, it's not even enough to erase the sin of a man. I, I have pity for some Christians today who are still involved in rituals by sacrificing a fowl or a goat. Satan will only mock you after you might have received whatever sacrifice you have given unto him. Revelation 1.5 
Unto him that loved us and washed every one of us from our sins in his own blood. So mo ona bo pada si bita akala wa mi oti ko ni be nya si apostle ori kata ti akala e kan I'm still very much in Acts chapter 3 that we read the other time oni ijare to re na ero nu pe wada ki e si tu yi pada ki a le pa ese yin re ki akoko itura ba le ti waju oluwa wa repent ye therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the lord ni oni atiki o ba le ran kinsi ti a ti yan fun yin ani jesu and you shall send jesus christ which before was preached unto you. That is a kidney. To do what? And it is a rule. It is a magba. Titi digba mukpanda bosipo ongbogbo. Ti alaron te sa. Lata no anwo li mi mare. Ti wan tin be ni ba ti ayete se. Whom the heaven must receive until the times of restitution of all things, which God has spoken by the mouth of all His holy prophets since the word began. Jesus, that day sadu na rorekwe. Jesus said in his words that all what the prophet said about him will come to pass. They will all come to pass. What a pity. Because the prophet said but also Daniel, to a woe born for that, a yinimal dam of four, a mag bad one. Before God created man in those days, He had already created what man will make use of. After that, He created man, and He told the man that, behold, all these things are for your own benefit. Eh, suba, eh, suti, say, moro ke, onti. Oto ma je ba nu je fun esu kan to fi se kan to to ja so pope olorun da damu o fi sinu ogba ogba eden god created adam and he put him in that garden at eden o si da be ani pe esu na ni gba ise da re na o da bi pe eden na ni a fi sinu ogba 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 eden ni 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 bugbe re looking at the history of satan it seems as if his abode was also the same garden of Eden. He had sinned and he had been sentenced ever before Adam was created. No wonder he did not allow man to enjoy the program of God until. He destroyed them. Destroyed them. It is the desire of God Almighty to restore everything. It is His wish for people to enjoy His program. And I have this personal sorrow because Satan does not allow people to know that the good things Christ uh, God is about to do in the United future is meant for mankind. From all things that are bad in the world, sorrow that is in the world. So the matter of peace of man, uh, Satan does not allow man to see that. Lati fi yon kwe, 
1 John 5 19 states that Satan is the president of the world right now. The whole world right now is under the jurisdiction of Satan. No wonder it's what Keep some multiplying in the world. We have proliferation of uh, religions in the entire world. As that is uh, increasing, so also the work of Satan. Lies no really are ye that is more than fair quite our story unless jesus comes to restore peace back to man there is nothing satan can do in the world right now that can bring peace to man banka awa mo pe ti olorun ni wa ati gbogbo aye ni o wa ni agbara ni buburu ni ti olorun ni wa we have god we all know that we are of God and the whole world lies under that wicked man. Who is that wicked man? That is the man we are talking about now. What I have just said will give Satan serious headache. It will give him great sorrow. Is the world president now? I wrote that description on that very board through what the Bible says. Unless Jesus comes, the world cannot know peace. But Satan does not allow people to know this. So he has made that to remain in secret until now. We are not going to read the place in the Bible to compare it with what I've just said. We are not going to read the Bible. Luke 19. Yes. Luke 37 to 42. 37 to 42. <laughs> I want to know, you know, I want to see, Lia would just see me full pay, or look on it, but I want my right way, or sit down alone, or we full pay, but we full ye, be our own way back by no one more, I want to put a yoke in the socket. Two forty two. Nibba tells us to make it, or she do a luna, or so I could see Lori, or we pay, if I shake by one more, Lonnie ye, and Niwa. When Jesus rode on that very earth, Unto uh, that very place, and uh, the disciples were shouting, Blessed be the king that cometh in the name of the Lord, peace in heaven and glory in the highest. Then the Pharisees told Jesus to rebuke his disciples. Jesus was offering, Jesus told them, If I tell them to keep quiet, the stones will immediately cry out. Yes, but yet to war, yet so much as I am missing. The battle so may till it. Oh, see you will, Luna, yet yes, I am. Tiawa, Loria, it is okay. Oh, so much you will notice. When he was very close to Jerusalem, where the religionists were, 
he wept over them. Oh, we pray, but as a prayer, one man learning ye, and they want to say, Tell our fear, as when they say ye, or Pama Prolo, you are saying, If thou had known, even thou at least in this thy day, the things which belong unto thy peace, but now they are hid from your eyes. Oh, don't have a call you one by any pay. If your baton were there being Kede ye, or you couldn't your baton, but your baton, but I want to a Kede ye, or none near Lafia one. Lie, Jeppe, yes, who they lie, Jeppe, your banner, they one in Lafia, oh, what Lafia, your power, lie, they, your banner, and in Lafia. What he wanted them to see right there is that if they had known, they wouldn't have asked him to rebook his disciples because Jesus was trying to talk about the matter of their peace. And if Jesus doesn't come, they cannot know peace. Yes. Well, they can have peace. So lie Without the descent of this kingdom we are talking about, the entire world cannot have peace. Oh, the Christmas to 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 when the world president in person of Jesus Christ, by the time he comes, then there shall be peace throughout the land. Read it again. Psalm 72. Psalm 72. 7 to 8. Verses 7 and 8. Ni ojo re ni awon olodun yo gbile ati opolopo lafia ni won bi o wa yo ni pe to owo si ga ba lati okun di okun ati lati olori si di okun aye. In his days shall the righteous flourish. Remember, You should not forget we said that in the morning that the wicked must have been removed. Why the meek are going to inherit the land and they shall continue to rejoice. In all things. In his days, the righteous shall flourish. Back in the book, I want to Christian. See, boy, is a coso, book, boy, lady. And just a coso, Nigeria, will be better, better, my number, lady. Just a coso, one. I want you to say, I want you to ask a coso. Nitori Nara, Tidolama, Nitori, go to Ayama, or go to Aron, to one day, or to Jutia Yellow. To those who are going to be appointed as administrators over there in heaven, they are righteous people, and they are not going to administer uh, just for the sake of naira and dollar. No, the glory they are going to have in heaven will be more than that of the world. Ni ojo re ni awo olododo yo gbile ati opolopo alaafia ni won bi o supa yo te pe. The righteous are going to flourish in his days abundance of peace so long as the moon and the earth. Ana ni o wa mu gbugbu aso tele ta ta te so la la ti pile ja pata pata wa wa se mu se. Then all those prophecies said about him shall come to pass. I would just want us to pray that Christ should come on time. He should come in bank, bank, I wait for image. Revelation 22. The farewell address from Jesus to his church. Revelation 22, 20. Revelation 22, verse 20. And it's your daddy, come on, you will be. Little talk, and you will be. Ami Mabo, yes, so Lua, yes. And it's your Jerry, come on, you will pray. Nito, toy me, Bok, Talo Saro, yes, yes, you sorrow. Toy me, Bok, Kakor, or a kind here to buy your son. Oh, my seal. Is that you come with your sorry a part of Christian? He which does it fight this says yet, surely I come quickly. Who was talking there? Jesus Christ. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. But it's a pity. Satan does not allow people to know this. He down with your see. It's your order. You know, Nick. Amen. My boy. Jesus. The response from church is that Amen. 
Even so, come Lord Jesus. Jesus. I want us to pray unto Jesus to please come in earnest. Lie de Jesus. Wala ye yo ma posi ni epe koi na ye ule bi na Without the coming of Christ, the problem and calamity in the world shall continue to multiply. Ne wa ngwa ti gbo gba ye ba suwa ni abi akoso eni boborori e ma re ti alaafi afaye. In as much as the whole world is still under the control of Satan, nobody should expect peace in the world. Suba ni gba to ba de when it comes. Alaafi afi gbo gba ye. There shall be peace for mankind. Li ojo re ni awon lo bebe yo gbele ati opolopo alaafia bi o su pa yo te pe tu. In his days shall the righteous flourish and that there shall be abundant peace so long as the moon endure yo si joba lati okunde okun lati odoni titi de ofa ni gbo gba agbaye pata he shall reign from sea to sea and from one end to another end he shall reign in the whole world you will now thank Jesus on my behalf. You will stand up <laughs> to pray. The last prayer point in the Bible. Amen. Jesus said, He which testified this thing yet, surely I come quickly. Then the church responded by saying, Amen. Even so, come Lord Jesus. Oh, lastly and sincerely, I want you to pray that Jesus will come. If you have that understanding about the coming of Christ, for the liberty of the whole creation we are talking about, so if we first of all deliver, if we liberate us and take us to the city of God in heaven, if we us and take us to the city of God in heaven, we have no place, we have no place there before. He willingly demanded for that place for us for his Please father. John 17, 24. In John 1724. Father, I want those who have have given us to me. Lord, me. Be with me. Let them see my glory that you have given to me. Thou lovest me before the foundation of the world. He demanded for that place for the Because man did not have any place in that place. So every belongs to God, he has given us. And when man received the cast of death, you are dust and you are going to return to save. Jesus does not serve it. He now asks for that place for his father. He told his son, Don't be sorrowful. I want to go to the father. I will go and prepare a place for you. Have you done that? I will come again. I will come to myself. Where are you? I will be there also. I will come first before the deliverance of the entire, the rest of the world. I will come first before the deliverance of the entire, the rest of the world. I will come first before the deliverance of the entire, the rest of the world. I will come first before the deliverance of I said this for you to know how you should pray. Honestly, how should you pray? Oh, not tell me that Jesus should come on time. Oh, but say, my boy, 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 say, to pray unto Jesus as we are friends here, that Jesus the Lord should come. Let us thank Jesus to have pity for the world. Sympathy for the world. Let us pray for the world. Let us pray that Christ should come and deliver us from the trouble we are experiencing in the world. Please come and deliver us. 
Everything is becoming worse day by day. Let us please pray unto the Lord. That God should come quickly. That He should come on time. That He should please come on time. My desire is that Jesus should come in this year we are about to enter into. Let us appeal to the Lord Jesus that He should come. Pray. 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 Let us pray that cash should come on time. Please pray unto God now. I do listen to what news on my television. I don't always listen to states. Uh, news or national news. If I want to listen to news on radio, it should be what news. But on my TV, I do what news. If I want to listen to news on the radio, it should be what news. Listen to what news. There are problems all over the world. And without the arrival of Christ, nothing can be done. Please pray that Christ should come. Quickly, so that uh, an end will come to whatever trouble we are passing through. That an end should come to the trouble of the world. Please let us pray unto the Lord. Abiyah, wa uti to ra 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 ra. Jeka badiya. Kolu atete mabo. Your prayer is not enough. Let us pray that Christ should come on time in order to put an end to the troubles people of the world are facing. Let us pray that Christ should come on time in order to put an end to the troubles people of the People who are saying that Christ should not come now, they don't understand this. Ah, Allah by your kids who told you, you know, go to Sokule, one of the people, Allah, if you have a family, you know. No wonder Jesus looked at that city and he wept over there because they are matter of peace. And what is more, Allah, if you have a family, you know, Allah, if you have a family, we know that the coming of the Lord is our peace. Hey, you have a family, you know, Allah, if you have a family, you know, Allah, if you have a family, you know, Allah, if you have a family, God that our day of peace should come. Our day down the road, our day of 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 our day Daily, that you should come. If you pray, the Lord will come on time. Solution, solution. You pray on a bayo, solution, solution. That is the only way out.